everyone, this is Zoe from the Sun Island Children's Museum and for this month's Second Saturday Science we're going to learn about water pollution and conservation efforts through this interactive oil spill cleanup activity. Our increasing reliance on oil and petroleum products has resulted in multiple marine oil spills at offshore drilling sites and from transport vessels. Oil spills are detrimental to the health of marine environments and marine organisms. Scientists and volunteers try to remove oil from open ocean and coastal environments when oil is spilling in order to lessen the effects that the oil will have on the ecosystem. For today's activity, we will focus on three different cleanup methods that scientists and volunteers use. Skimming, absorbing, and dispersing of oil. For materials, you're going to need the following things. Oil, any type of vegetable oil. Soap, I'm using Dawn dish soap. Sponges, these are some old ones that I cut up. A mason jar, or any type of jar that you could scoop stuff into. Cornstarch, a shallow tray or baking dish with water. Some cotton balls. And a spoon. Let's begin experimenting with our three methods of cleanup. So what you're going to do is you're going to make sure you have your tray or bowl filled with water. I put a little bit of blue food coloring in to make it easier to see. And now you're going to take your vegetable oil and you're going to pour some of that vegetable oil into your bowl. Our bowl with water represents the ocean and our vegetable oil represents the oil spill. You can see now the difference in the oil and the water, how it separates. Now we're going to try our first method, skimming. To begin skimming, you're going to take your spoon and your jar. Make sure you have your jar close by. During an oil spill, volunteers and scientists will take shovels or other types of scooping tools to scoop out the oil just like we're doing right now with the spoon. So you want to very carefully try to get underneath the oil and pick it up and scoop it into the bowl. What you'll find is that the oil is very slick and it's not easy to capture it all. Our next method is absorbing. So we're going to try different ways to absorb the oil that is in our bowl. The first two ways we're going to absorb our oil is with a sponge and our cotton ball. At a real oil spill site, you'll see buoys with different types of sponges attached to them, and those will absorb the oil the best they can. They use different types of materials to make these sponges, just like we're using today. As you probably noticed, both the sponge and the cotton ball didn't absorb all the oil next type of absorbent we're going to use is cornstarch. Now you're going to carefully use your spoon and sprinkle some of the cornstarch into your bowl right over the oil. If you were at a real-life oil spill cleanup, a way they would do a similar method is using sand. The sand would help absorb the oil and they would use those same shovels when they're skimming to help scoop up the big piles of sand that are soaking up the oil. Just as you saw with our skimming method and our other types of absorbents, this wasn't successful in picking up all of the oil. Which leads us to our final method, disparent. Our disparent is our soap, our liquid dish soap. They actually use Dawn dish soap out in real oil spills to help clean the animals when they're covered in oil. Now pay close attention to here. This is a really cool part. Watch as we drip the soap into the oil. What do you see happens? Isn't that cool? Let's watch it one more time. The disparent really helped break up the oil. So now, in combination with the other two methods, skimming and absorbent, we're able to easily pick up much more of the oil. And that concludes our experiment. Can you think of different methods to clean up oil spills? How effective were the methods we tried today? Why is it important to take care of our ocean? Tell us what you learned and answer some of our questions by following us on social media and sending us your pictures and answers. Thanks so much. Bye.